Hey everybody, Dave here, one of the developers for Access Manager. Just want to give you a quick tour of the plugin. Here I have my backend admin setup. I'm currently on the Access to Categories tab. When you first install Access Manager, it will be all locked down. If you want access to the public for non-logged in users, then you'd go ahead and click on the read only button. And then you'd start choosing the categories that you want the users to see on the front end for non-logged in users. Let's go ahead and give some access to the public. I'll choose the read only button. I'll choose these categories here, the child categories. I'll save. Here's what the front end looks like. This is for non-logged in users. And they can see all articles nested within these categories that we gave them access to. Let's go ahead and give them another one. For example, accounting, save. Reload, and here you can see accounting and two articles. Uh, you can see programming courses, the category its name as well, because of its because of accounting is nested underneath it, and that's why you can see it. They won't have access to any articles nested in program courses or any subcategories, but the structure is visible. Let's remove that access. Save. And reload here we go we have no more access now let's say I want to give them access to one article within that category but I don't want them to have access to the the whole list of articles within that category so I'm going to access to articles and I'm going to choose financial accounting level one save come back here reload the front end and here again, we see the structure accounting and program courses, because that's where financial accounting is nested under. Thank you for watching. If you need more groups like teachers and students, and you need them to have access to certain categories and articles, and also different permissions for editing, uh, go see our KB Groups add-on. I think it would be a great solution for you.